What's up, everybody? Me, Nick, and the very cool gang are here at A.W. Meyer. What's up, everyone? For 2019's 36th annual Oktoberfest. We're gonna take a look at some awesome offerings from some of the largest tool manufacturers in the entire nation. What do you think about that, guys? Right good to me. Let's do it. comes with the plunge base, which has dust extraction. It also comes with a collar for the dust extraction. If I made two cuts with this without the vac, that blade would be hot, you wouldn't be able to touch it. I could hook up my vac and make 30 cuts, so you could touch that blade all day. So not only does it help the smoothness of the cuts, it helps keep the blade nice and cool. Um, the plunge cut's got a magnetic tip on it, so it stabilizes the, you know, the blade when you're using it. But uh, give this thing a run so you can see the set of balls that it has on it. You can cut right into the oak. So should we do put the vac on it or no? What do you want to do? It's up to you. I'll vacuum it up after if you want. We clamp down? Yeah. It's so this, this, is a, this is a sustainer MFT. So this is a storage box that doubles as a worktop. Nice. You can take the quick clamps and you can clamp any base material to it so you can sand or cut on it. Watch this. Yo, that thing's unreal. You said this is oak. That's oak, yeah. Did you say that before or no? This yeah, is a it's, red it's oak. oak. Yeah, it is oak. <laughs> I put the dust extractor on just so you can see the difference. That thing's brand new, huh? Yeah, this just came out. Yo, that thing's unreal. Going through oak? Yo, I've used a lot of multi tools. Well, that's why you gotta use it, yeah, because this will put the fine uh, to chain and set. So, this got our Bluetooth switch on it. Yeah. This will turn the back on and off. This little switch, this little button. Here's my back, turn it yeah. on. The button, it'll turn it on again. Now, these are Bluetooth batteries, so you sync this battery to the vacuum. It'll turn on automatically. You turn the tool on, it'll turn on automatically. You make some cuts with that thing. It's a lot of suction. I was going to say, it'd be good if you guys show the video one without the hose. That's it. Not going to help that way. You ready? Got it? Change the blade for you. Change the blade? That blade's unreal. So these blades, the way the five star max locks, you just take it and you just switch it on. It locks in, and it gets to go. That's fast. You ready? If you were using that without the vacuum, that blade is locked. Very smooth. Little more finesse. This, this is unbelievable. It, it, I, I will say, it, it really does. That's the thing. In see the video, people won't realize. That's why I have to mention. This is oak, not pine. That's why we put it. Yeah, we unbelievable. Put it. But do your blades fit the wall? Do walls for building birdhouses? <laughs> <laughs> or, do, 
<laughs> we're doing fine woodworking here. Yeah, we're doing fine woodworking. No, no, it's um, it'll. So this is a five-star lockback, so it'll take most blades. The new one, yeah, yeah. So this is a depth stop, which you're not gonna need. But you make sure so you can plunge. Cut it straight off. It's unreal. Always, I'm always so amazed every time I demo these tools. Nice. I'm glad. Because you're, I mean, you're testing out all types of tools. So. And guess what? Your the, feedback's good feedback. The vibration is is. No, it's very minimal. Yeah. Very, very minimal. minimal now the bunch base shit. If you were going into drywall, uh -huh. you were up against the wall. Imagine all that dust. Guys, electricians putting in accesses or putting in plugs or whatnot. It'd be, you know, it'd be a mess. Now the long blade is for the, the base, so you put what's, the shorter what's blade. What's the price point on that? So this is $7.99, two batteries and a charger, $5.99 for the bare tool. So, okay, but it does come with the plunge base. Correct. It comes with the dust extraction for the collar. Right. Also with the plunge base with the depth stop, two batteries and a charger. How many blades? Any? Uh, it might come with one blade. One blade. Yeah. We make scrapers, a multitude of blades. One of the cool things about Starlock Max is that most companies make a Starlock Max blade. So fine, Bosch. If a guy has a box full of blades that he's been using for a couple of years, right? He can put it right on the is Festool. There, is there any advantage to using the Festool blade? Yeah, the Festool blades. I mean, they're going to last longer. Anything Festool is using is going to last longer because it's made more durable. You know, the, the materials that they use are higher grade materials than a, you know, just a, a cheap blade that comes from Asia. Per this one. Perfect. You can always dial it down and use it on low. I was wondering. Yeah. Well, the the variable speed helps. Just in case, you know, you want to be delicate. I can, and if you really got to crank it up to get aggressive. Even on speed can, one. Even on low speed. Unbelievable. I got to tell you, I'm thoroughly impressed. And if you're thoroughly impressed, then smash the like button. Raymond, I appreciate, what are we, what are we doing? We we're doing more. <laughs> I got you here. So that's our new grinder as well. And that's got a flat disc on it. So imagine a guy that does woodworking, carving, you know, the grinder's kind of most, it's a versatile tool. Yes. You know, woodworkers will find all types of MacGyver uses for a grinder. Definitely. You know, so they'll put wire cut brushes on there, steel wheels, diamond wheels, you know, regular abrasives, diamond grid abrasives, flat disc like we have. What are we demoing, anything? Probably just saying the- Saying my, my, my bad cuts over here? Yeah, if, you, if you want to, yeah, you can cut that flat. Yeah. Absolutely. I gotta tell you. I mean, it's just quick work, I'll tell you that much. And if you like quick work, then smash the like button. Raymond. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, guys. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you on the next one. What did you think of that? That was awesome. Man. Great awesome. time. Crazy deal. Yes. Would you hit the? Would Most you hit? Tools I've ever seen. You think you guys hit the like button? Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Hit it three times. Should they tap the bell and get subscribed? Absolutely. I guess we'll all see you on the next one. Hey, everybody. There you go.